Hi, I'm JV with your Mountain Tips Mountain Tricks. So for the average mountaineer, when we first start out, we're climbing something like Avalanche Gulch or the Disappointment Cleaver, uh, some of the easier routes on Mount Hood. We generally start out climbing in um, the better times of the year when the snow conditions are you know, firm but not really hard. But as we progress, what happens is, is we get into harder ice, like this past weekend when we were on the Hotlum Glacier and it was blue ice almost the whole way up. Or this upcoming weekend in September when we're going to be climbing uh, the North Kular on uh, North Peak. In that case, we're going to be front pointing and their crampons really matter. We really need them to get good purchase. Our crampons are what connect us to the mountain. It's what keeps us there. So if our crampon points aren't sharp, and our crampons aren't well taken care of, uh, then we run a, a pretty big risk of, of uh, not being able to complete our goal or even falling or being injured. So it's really important we take care of them. First, most basic step is don't walk on a rock when you have your crampons on. I know sometimes it's not possible. You have to short, cross a short uh, section of, of scree or talus. Um, but when you can help it, don't walk on rock because it definitely dulls your crampon points. And as we're going to see right here, um, once your crampon points are dull, there's a few tricks to taking care of them and maintaining them. So go ahead and get your crampons, get a small file, metal file, and let's get to work. Okay, so I don't need anything special. I just have actually some old hand-me-down files. Um, when I'm on a trip, a Leatherman file works really well. You can sharpen up a, a crampon mid-expedition. Uh, I don't like to use electrical grinders, mostly because you can take off too much metal. And if you're not really skilled with them, you can actually heat up the aluminum and make it weaker. These front points actually have been known to break um, if, if you don't know what you're doing. So first step, I'm gonna just go through, I'm gonna feel each of the points in the front, also in the back. Um, remember, these are really important for on the downhill. Um, I get up here to the front point and I actually have a little burr here that I'm feeling for um, from where I kicked a rock. I'm just going to take my file, give it a few short strokes, try and smooth out the metal. Once I've got it smoothed, I figure out an angle and try and stay consistent with it the whole time. Working that down on both sides until I can get a good sharp point. You don't have to be super skilled. This is a very basic thing, but you can sharpen up your points um, enough that it's easier to climb on ice in icy conditions. Also, just make it safer for yourself. As always, I hope this, this is good information. It helps you out and it helps make you safer. If you have any questions or comments, if you have any suggestions or videos you'd like to see, just shoot me an email jb at swsmtns.com and hopefully we'll see you in the mountains. Thanks.